But literally, as soon as I start filming, it starts raining. And I'm not closing my window because it's too hot here and I've already turned the fan off so there's no like white noise for that. So <sighs> be grateful. Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, today I'm gonna be doing like a life update, like what's been going on in my life because I kind of just came back to YouTube and like didn't say anything about what's been happening. So I'm gonna update you guys on what's been going on. I'm literally sweating. Um, so yeah, I guess I'm just gonna get straight into it because there's literally no point in me rambling. So first I'm gonna talk about what I've been up to and like what I've been doing and why I haven't been posting. Honestly, haven't been posting because I didn't want it. I could not be bothered. I picked up the camera, tried to film a video, would delete it instantly because I'm like, no one's gonna watch this. I don't even know what I'm doing. And some videos I'll start editing and then be like, mm, deleting it because I don't even, <laughs> I don't even want to watch it. So no one else is gonna want to watch it. It is starting to rain really hard. So I am so sorry if that's all you can hear. I'm gonna shut my window, okay? Because I don't want this video to get ruined. Okay, well, you can still hear it. So it's fun. It's not as loud as it was before. That's why I haven't been posting. Um, just because I haven't had any motivation to and I haven't had any video ideas. But now I have like all these video ideas and I just keep making videos. And like I'm posting them all at once. So hopefully I don't post a lot of videos at once. And then like dry myself out and then not have anything to post. Because that would be really bad. Um, so hopefully that doesn't happen. Um, okay, next thing. What have I been doing? Nothing except working. I work at KFC currently. I know, it's so fun. It's so fun. It's actually not that bad. Like, I think if you work with good people that you get along with, work isn't that bad. So that's why I don't think KFC is that bad. Like, the job itself is crap. Like, I don't like it. But the people I work with are actually nice and make the job fun, which I think is important. And I actually just got a second job as a Christmas casual, like if you don't live in Australia or like Queensland or whatever, you probably won't know what that is. It's just like a summer job, kind of like you just have a job over the Christmas period to get you a little bit of extra money. So now I'm working two jobs. My second job for Christmas casual is Universal Store. I worked there last year for a Christmas casual as well. I don't know, it was really fun. So I'm like, why not do it again? So now I'm working two jobs. So that's really great. Got that KFC just count anyways so um yeah that's work um i'm so sorry if you can hear the rain i know it is so loud for literally no reason at all like so obnoxious like i waited until i had to go pick my brother up from school to film this video so i didn't have to get interrupted and now i'm getting interrupted by rain so that's really rude the next thing this is a really fast life update but honestly when i watch videos like this i don't like when people ramble on about the same thing for ages so i'm just gonna keep going so next thing, relationship. I am still dating Tyler, as you would have seen in my last videos. Yeah, I'm still with him. He lives with me. We've been together for a year and a half at the end of this month. So love that for us. I don't know, there's nothing really to say there. Like everything's fine. And hopefully we're moving out next year, like middle of next year, like middle to start of next year. Just depends whether I can keep my second job because I cannot move out with my KFC wage because girl, that is not getting me enough money. But yeah, me and Tyler are still together. Hopefully moving out next year. Definitely moving out next year actually. Love him, love that. We're vibing, we're thriving. Next subject, let's keep going. Now, I'm. this is probably gonna be in the title of the video, so this is probably what you've come here for, but my tattoo, you probably have seen it in my other videos. I just haven't mentioned it yet, or maybe I have, I don't know if I have or not. I don't think I have, but it's just like a little bouquet of flowers. There she is. I got it in like September, the start to middle of September this year. And honestly, my camera battery is gonna die, but let's just keep recording until it dies. If it cuts off randomly, you know why. But honestly, it didn't hurt that bad. It was kind of just like a little uncomfortable like vibration feeling. It like didn't hurt actually. It didn't hurt at all. It just gets really uncomfortable. And depending where you're getting your tattoo, it is just such an uncomfortable position. Like I had to sit there like this and it was so uncomfortable. So uncomfortable and it only took like 20 to 30 minutes to do so like it really wasn't that bad but props to the people who get like like massive things because I could never can never sit there for that long and do that that's what that is and it didn't really have a meaning when I got it I made one up so like <laughs> I honestly just say like I don't even remember the meaning that I made up I think it was like my Nana and Poppy my mom my dad my two brothers and my sister. I don't, 
I don't know, it was some stupid thing like that. When I got it, it didn't have a meaning, but I just made that up, so love that. And yeah, if you live in Queensland, Brisbane, you'll know where this place is probably. I got them at Celebrity Inc. at Chermside, and they were really good. The people there are super nice, and they always make an effort to like remember who you are. So when you go there again, you just feel welcomed. So yeah, that's my tattoo, that's the tea on that. And the next thing, which other people, people probably actually came here for, is my... My boobs. I got my nips pierced. I don't know if I can say that on YouTube. And I feel like there's gonna be a lot of people coming here to be a little perv. And I'm sorry, Nana and Poppy, if you're watching this video, or even my dad, or literally anyone that knows me, I'm sorry. But I got my nips pierced at like the start of January this year. And honestly, it didn't even hurt. I put numbing cream on, it was fine. My friend did it because she's a body piercer, so she did it for me pain out of 10 i would say not painful just uncomfortable once again because i couldn't feel it but it was just like you knew something was going on so it's just uncomfortable the healing time is real fast and no pain for me at least some people might say otherwise but so yeah that's my life update i hope you guys enjoyed i just talked about random stuff really fast because once again i don't like sitting there and watching people talk about the same stuff or like five minutes straight so hopefully you guys could tolerate this video and actually watch it let me know what videos you want to see because i genuinely do not know and i'm just going to keep making random videos like this i'm trying to get to 4,000 subscribers so please subscribe please share um like the video and i'll see you in my next video bye guys